Hey everyone, Jason from Back in Motion Newcastle and Cessnock. So just to let everyone know that we are transitioning from Bodyworks Physio, we're now part of the Back in Motion group. But today I'm here to talk about elbow problems. So tennis elbow is one of the common things we see. That's the old sort of name for it. Now there's other names included, including epicondylalgias, epicondylopathies, um, which they're all basically combinations of pain or degeneration and inflammation in through the tendons in your forearm. Now we commonly see these in people that overuse their forearm with repetitive actions like typing, um, builders, carpenters, anybody that's doing a repetitive gripping or small movement with their hand. And basically the little tendon in there has a poor blood supply, so it's really slow to heal. So what I wanted to do today is give you a quick demonstration on how we would apply dry needling to this area to help stimulate blood flow and help relax the muscles to take pressure off this injury. So I've already sterilized my hands before we've done this. We do this with all sterile single-use needles and we always have, make sure we have clean hands before applying it. We want to find the tendon where we're um, targeting and then we just, just gently tap it in and progress that down until we touch the structure we're aiming for, which is the little common extensor tendon. And so I'm applying some needles in at the tendon site. So the theory being that when we apply these needles to this area, we get vasodilation, so all the blood vessels open up around it, as well as the body's immune system kicks in and recognizes these needles as a foreign body, so that it stimulates increased healing in that area. And then I'm also going down into the muscles of the forearm, so Kim might be able to feel a few little twitches yeah. in here which is where those nerves are firing off in the muscle, making the muscle contract around them. So our standard treatment would be to leave these for a second, for about 30 seconds to a minute, stimulate them all again by gently moving them. That's sometimes not the most pleasant part. Afterwards, pull them out, doing some massage in through that help loosen up the muscles, and follow it up with some homework, including stretching, and then later on getting onto what we call some eccentric strengthening exercises that specifically target the tendon. But it all has to be monitored by your physiotherapist to make sure you grade it and progress it within the injury's recovery rate. So I hope that gives you some information about how we treat lateral epicondylopathies or tennis elbow pain. Give us a call on 4952-7033 if you'd like more information or to book in for an assessment. Thanks and have a great day.